Hey, what's up, you guys? Welcome back to another video. First and foremost, as always, I would like to thank you guys for all of the support. It is greatly appreciated. This channel slowly grows every single day, and I cannot thank you guys enough. I really do appreciate all of you guys' support. If you are new to my channel, go ahead and subscribe, drop a like, look forward to the future, and let's continue to grow this channel. So today I have another shoe review for you guys, but before I even show you guys the shoes, I want you to know the three categories is price, looks, comfort. Now, when it comes down to judging comfort, I am a nurse assistant I work 12 hour shifts on average I walk about eight miles per day and I stand for double digit hours every single day so when it comes down to comfort trust me now these are the Puma Pacer future sneakers all right in the black and white colorway now I will be throwing these on so you can get our own feet 360 get into the pricing so these are on shoecarnival.com for $69.99 but just for a fun fact and just put y'all on game real quick if you shop at shoecarnival.com they allow Klarna payments Klarna allows you to make four zero percent interest payments but you will receive the shoe so you don't have to worry about paying off the shoe and then receiving it You'll just pay the initial payment, which is well under $20, along with your other payments, and you get the shoe. So for me, it's very convenient, and I mean, if you just don't want to shed out a whole bunch of money up front, you could just go through Shoe Carnival and use Klarna. But I will be dropping the link down in the description below to Amazon if you want to check these out. And that's for the people out there who probably don't trust Klarna, never heard of Klarna, never heard of Shoe Carnival, so boom. I'll just let you decide how you want to get it, but the link will be down in the description below for these. Again, $69.99, they definitely do not break the bank, and to me, honestly, they are well worth it. Now on into the looks. To me, these look very dope, okay? You got Puma on the back. Again, this is the black and white colorway. I just, when I saw these, I just loved the design and they just looked super nice, okay? They just looked super nice to me. And these are very lightweight, so these may look like they're kind of a bulky shoe, but they're really not that heavy whatsoever. So and now on into the more important things, comfort. Now again, I am a nurse assistant. I stand for double digit hours every single day. I walk about seven to eight miles every single day. So, I mean, when it comes down to comfort, comfort is a very, very important thing when it comes down to my shoes, all right? These right here, I am not gonna lie. They do have the soft foam. I don't know if you can see it, but they do have the soft foam cushion. I'm not gonna lie. It feels like you're walking on clouds, but if you are like me, you work, I'll say over eight hours, these are not the shoes for you, your feet will start to hurt, okay? I was doing pretty good on my shift. Again, it's 12 hours, around like that seven to eight hour mark of just walking and standing around and stuff like that. These were starting to kill my feet. So when it comes down to comfort, I have to give it a way lower rating. This is not a shoe that I will wear to work, especially during 12 hours or like 15 hours. Now, if I'm on call and I have to go in for a couple of hours, I do not mind throwing these on, but 12 hours and up, it's a wrap. I am not doing it. I refuse to. I literally wish I had brought some backup shoes in my truck because that's how bad my feet were hurting. Like, it was ridiculous. But here you go. This one last look, all right? So overall, the looks, I mean, come on now. You cannot say that's not a dope sneaker, all right? So the looks are there, all right? The pricing is only $69.99. $70 for this now, that is not bad at all. We all know there are some way uglier shoes that cost way more, but there's no here nor there. But $70, you really can't beat it, all right? But comfort. If you're working extended hours, I'm gonna tell you now, if you work over eight hours, I would say don't worry about them. They are not the most comfortable. Casually wearing this to like go to the gym, if you want to just casually walk or if you're just going to work for like a few hours just to collect like a little overtime for instance perfectly fine these are shoes that you can wear but extended hours no and just another side note when it comes down to me wearing these to the gym which i have done a couple of times on leg day i really did not like the sole of these because they were too soft all right so whenever i was doing squats and leg press it felt like my feet weren't in one spot it felt like my feet were pressing into the sole and then 
pushing the weight, you know, and I did not like that. It kind of, I don't know, it just felt weird. So if you are trying to do leg day and you go up like heavy in weight, I would not really recommend these. I have some other shoes that I really prefer on leg day and this is not one of them. So uh, out of five stars, I'll go ahead and give it like a three because comfort is like the biggest factor for me. I have to stand all those hours. I have to walk all of those hours. I have a lot of stuff to do in a day. I cannot afford to have my feet hurting mid shift. If it is not a comfortable shoe, I just can't fool with it. Not saying that this is not a comfortable shoe. This only is bad for long periods of time, okay? For the most part, very comfortable, very cushiony, like perfect, but eight hour mark, yeah, I wouldn't do it. But that's it for today's video. Thank you guys for tuning in. I hope you enjoy. Again, if you are new to my channel, go ahead and subscribe, drop a like, look forward to the future, and let's continue growing this channel. Again, I really do appreciate all of you guys' support. I'm in the process of moving, so I'm kind of making some fun videos so I don't have to worry about stressing to make videos to upload to YouTube. So you guys can be entertained while I'm in the moving process, but thank you guys for tuning in. I will see you guys in the next video. I'm out.